Jared here welcome back another video and if you like the videos do make sure you subscribe hit the like button on the videos you like comment on anything you'd like me to improve on and I will make sure I look into that and help the channel grow so today we'll be looking at how to set up Kali Linux aka NetHunter on your mobile and in this specific series of tutorials you will be able to make sure that Kali Linux runs you'll have a desktop GUI you'll have everything that you have on your desktop version and on the bright side you do not need to root your device unlike the previous videos that you've ever seen online most of the videos on youtube tell you that you require root access in this video i will show you exactly how to do that and how not to have root access or you don't really need to void your warranty you can enjoy any linux di distro on your device so long as it's supported by the vnc viewer system and that you have a tamax setup also it's a good thing to make sure that you have a hacker's keyboard what the hacker's keyboard does you see in linux more often than not you require to maybe scroll up scroll down let's look at that you need to scroll up scroll down and you need to change certain things say you need to look at the history of maybe the commands that you've been giving and so many other things so what the hackers keyboard does it sort of brings the whole desktop experience to mobile as you can see right now you have the mic you have the escape buttons you have all the symbols you have your shift control and if your phone supports multi-finger touch screen up to five fingers this will do the trick for you for example you can have a control alt delete command you can have a command maybe command r to run something also you can have the up and down scroll buttons so that you can quickly check the previous commands that you had written down so the next thing we are going to be looking at sorry for that the next thing we are going to be looking at is going to be the net hunter store what the net hunter store does in this specific series of tutorials i will be showing you how to set up kali linux so the net hunter store provides most of the things that you require to make sure kali linux is running on your mobile platform without having to root your device so by simply avoiding rooting your device again you preserve your warranty so that your device should anything ever go wrong you never mess with the bootloader and thus you can receive whatever reimbursements you wanted so as you can see some of the things here is the hackers keyboard the GUI that allows you to have a Kali Linux sort of experience on mobile you can have a Wi-Fi firmware and this will allow you to run applications such as Airgeddon and so many more things in that specific region in case of open source softwares you have that you have open vpn and so much more so much more those who've used rf tools you know how powerful these are you can perform spectrum visualization you can perform sniffing and spoofing as you can see here and all these are things that were initially thought of to be restricted to the pc version of kali linux arc linux parrot os and all these other powerful distros say you have a usb keyboard you have your interfaces here and this will allow you and your mobile version of linux to interpret everything that you have connected to your device so this and so much more is gonna be reviewed in the next series of videos the next tool that we're gonna what an linux does is it allows you to have a desktop environment on mobile and this is the whole secret behind being able to run any linux distro that is supported by the tool on android otherwise if it's not here then you cannot have it so for example you can come here you can download your different root fs and this simply means that you can download different software versions so we can quickly try to do that i do not know how fast my internet is so let's come back here ah. 
asking for that again you need to download this but we'll be able to go through this in the next series of videos don't worry about that and so many many other things that you can do with this experience you can have a window manager your window manager will allow you to snap screen to have two different operating systems essentially what the vnc viewer allows you to do is you can have a complete windows or linux experience including the virtualization of all these tools so next thing don't worry about this this will facilitate me to do some sort of demonstration because i'm using a note and this will allow me to record in dex mode and so much more so the last thing we're gonna look at in this video is gonna be the tamax and i can tell you for a fact that this is the best part for all those terminal buffs this is it the tamax provides you with everything you require to run linux on android as you can see immediately when you start up you have your pkg installed and what we'll be doing in the next video will be installing various packages so make sure that you have at least 1.5 gigs of space this is to ensure that you are able to download a linux distro to ensure that your linux packages can be unpacked successfully and that you can install them another thing i'd highly recommend is to make sure that you get the hackers keyboard and this is what the hackers keyboard does so for example if i was to type in a, let's see what, what, what i'm looking for say apt get install say install what if you get you see i had tried installing it that's why we are getting this kind of notifications telling me that it's going to install four new packages and it's prompting me to install so say i did not want to install that normally in linux what you will do you just hit ctrl and c and it will cancel exactly what happens here but now the real question is would you be able to do that with your regular keyboard device <laughs> the regular android platform device say you're on samsung you're on a google phone you're on a what one plus whatever platform you're using these sort of features are not available so another quick thing that the hackers keyboard allows you to do you see right here the last command i put in so when i come back here and just hit the up arrow in the hackers keyboard notice what it does it behaves exactly like we have on the windows platform or on the linux platform when you're on the terminal or the command prompt so that's about it for this video just make sure that you've installed these applications make sure you have this make sure you have this make sure you have this and this and this if you like the videos hit me up like and subscribe share the videos uh, and one quick thing notice that the tamax remains running and this is gonna be very very critical going forward because once we download the packages and we install them or we run them by typing in a command such as nethunter or nh and setting a kex password by kex password this is what allows us to be able to log in using our vnc viewer so once you've set up your terminal and it's running the next thing will be to come here this will be stage two and then we'll be able to log into a terminal if you want to exit the tamax you can simply go in there type exit or just scroll down from the top go to your session and you can end it again from there so if you like the videos kindly hit me up like, like and subscribe to the channel and i'll be seeing you next week thank you